What's up guys, it is Sam here, and uh, myself and Kirk wanted to talk about, because if you lose all your gains after you cycle, because I feel like there's a myth out there that after you um, come off cycle, that you're going to lose all your gains. And, and we want to talk about that. So this is my buddy Kirk. What's up, guys? And you, he, so tell him about how long you were doing uh, a cycle and like what you were doing. Okay, so I started with um, I started with uh, Anadrol, uh, uh, testosterone, and um, Deca, like mixy, so you know all all together pretty much for, the, <laughs> for like three months, the first three months. And I put on like a substantial amount of weight. I put on like thirty pounds, right? Holy so yeah, I was like one eighty to then I went to one eighty to like like um two ten. It was crazy. So um, for a while I was just like I was scared to get off of it. I wanted to keep being on it because it felt so good. But I and the, the real reason I was scared to get off of it because I thought I was gonna lose my gains. But um, I finally I, I did it and I was like you know what I'm not doing that much right now. I'm just cruising with some tests right now. So I came off of it. I used the Clomed. Uh, that's the PCT for it, and I did about 12 days of Clomed. And well, did what do you? So you weren't you weren't doing um, Anadrol, uh, Test, and D ball all at the same time for the entire. No, oh no, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry about that. They, so for the first three months, I had um, uh, I had Deca and Anadrol in, in there too, as well as well as a Test, a higher dose of Test. What, then, were you, what were you taking? Like I think we were talked about. He was taking uh, what was it? 300 I think it was, yeah, I think it was, it, it was 500? yeah, because I remember when it was, when I came off of it, I was doing just a low, I was doing like one, 1.5 cc's right before I came off of it a week, so, um, but I would do, yeah, I would do probably, probably two cc's a week when I first started, and then I went down to one, uh, 1.5 to one at the very end, okay. and then, um, so, so, and you did that for the entire, so you did it for a total of two years, right? Oh yeah, I did, I did it, well, I did everything for about a year and a half. And that's including the orals. Uh, no, no, no. The orals were just were that just first uh, the first part? three months. Okay, yeah. okay. I didn't want. You know, and so you gained. So you gained about thirty pounds when you did all of them at once. And how uh, much? How much did you lose of that thirty pounds when you switched to just tests? Uh, I actually didn't lose any. I kept my gains. So you didn't have. You didn't lose any. No, of, I actually. I actually increased my eating and went up from there. I, I, I could easily hold two ten instead of like uh, barely two ten. I was holding like two twelve. So is it more like, um, is it more like when you kind of, as an analogy, if you were to go through a forest, right, and you, the first time you go through the forest, you got to like cut all the shit down and get through it, but like the next time you go through the forest, you can go a lot faster, and that's kind of like yes. the intuition of like where you would be at 210, exactly, exactly. because you went through once, now it's easy to stay at 210? Yes, it's, okay. it's easy, so so when I came, and then finally I, I was thinking like, you know what, if I can sustain it with just this little bit amount of test, I can, I can actually... Why not just get off of it completely? And I got off of it, right? Can you know never told cold turkey you know, I'd take some uh, PCT with it. So I got off of it, and the first few weeks I was like a little. Drained. And well, first of all, before you get into the mm. those, did, what did you do for PCT? Because that's gonna affect. Oh uh, yeah, so yeah. It was, it was your, if, you give, if you if you make your gains or not, or right, right. lose them. So that was Clomed. It's, it's an oral, right? So I did um, a total of uh, twelve days worth. So. I think I had like uh, 17 pills, so I did like the first five days were two pills a day. Then after the after the night, well, like the next seven days were like one pill a day. So um, I think I had, um, yeah, yeah. So it was about 12 days worth. So. And did you take anything else with the Clomid or just the Clomid? No, just the Clomid. Okay. And and so when you when you came when you were coming off the test, you were you stated around you were at 210 ish, right? Uh, yes. And, and when you came off. Um, how much did you drop down to, like, when you, after the cycle, like, I after really the 12 days? I really didn't, it didn't change much, like, like, I knew how many calories I'm supposed to be intaking to maintain, around maintain, to, so, I was around, like, 4,000, so I, that the, the first couple weeks I was down about it, and I, I think it's a mindset, it just messes with you, because, it's like, thinking, like, oh, you're off the, you're off the stuff, so you don't really need to eat and work out like you used to, but that's why people lose their gains, because it's that mental factor, so, what I did, um, I just I just kept eating, I kept eating um, like my calories, and then I just I just I just increased them even more, and I saw it, and it, it really didn't affect me that much getting off of stuff. Besides it, the tired part of it. So, but I, like, I, there, there's definitely the side effects when you get the psychological, as we were talking. Yeah, about. Yeah, psychological, and, and just the there's like a, a reduced drive to almost do anything yes um, it's a it, real mental it hits you mentally a lot. yeah but you don't realize it yeah. until 
until you're sitting there like two and a half or three weeks into it sometimes, mm-hmm. and then you realize it, and it's like, oh, I need to do something about it. Um, exactly. So I was like, e- the first two weeks, I wasn't eating that much, so I went down in my weight, you know, obviously. So I was like, you know what? Let me just, I know, I know I'm not eating how I used to. Why don't I just start eating... You know how how I how I used to on the on the stuff. So and what what about the um what about your reps and like um I and the say, weight yeah. in the in the gym. So so uh, my it went down my strength went down a little bit. I can I can still wrap out quite a few on everything I used to do. Um, just a lot right actually the same. So um, but my strength went down a little bit. Like maybe just uh, maybe just like 10, 10 pounds maybe on the bench and stuff like that. It was. I'm, I'm still strong in biceps, triceps, the same as how I was. Um, but a lot of it, again, I think a lot of it has to do with the mental. And how how long has it been so far? Um, since you, since since you off? came off. Yeah. Oh, it's been over two months. So a little bit over two months, maybe yeah. two and a half months? Maybe, yeah, maybe like, yeah, yeah something like that. Maybe and, nine and do you want to tell everybody how much you weigh? Oh, yeah, today we weighed in, right? So, yeah. like, it was um, around right around 215, maybe like, maybe like 213. So, so you actually gone up in weight. Um, have you now? Uh, I think a lot of people would probably think it's a lot a increase in fat. Um, do you, um, what are I your thoughts on where, where do you think it? No, I think it's. Um, I think my I may have dropped a little muscle weight, uh, but I feel like I'm still. I'm comparing myself to pictures that I used to be at and pumped at, at, at when I was on the stuff. So I'm not too far off. So I think I kept most of my muscle mass. That's uh, and that's what. His experience was with um, coming off cycle and not really losing any of the gains uh, from a muscle muscle so <laughs> <laughs> muscle situation from a muscle uh, point of view. But uh, there, de- other, there's definitely the psychological that's huge um, and the uh, little bit of strength loss, but. Primarily, the biggest effect is the psychological. I would say, by far, I don't know if, if you agree, but uh, I think the when you come off test, the biggest thing is a hundred percent psychological, not physical things. But anyways, if you guys have any other questions, let us know down below in the comments, um, and uh, don't forget to subscribe if you want to see content like this in the future. I talk about all sorts of shit like this, and if you want to uh, ask a question. Um, and you don't want to leave it in a pri- uh, public forum like the comment section here, reach out to me on Instagram. The link is in the description. Peace.